these students are going to be playing a game that we call the digit game. So again, we have a box of cards, and each player gets two cards. They draw their cards, and then they compare their cards. So, Olivia, let's show the... You have a four and a three. So what's the biggest number that you can make out of a four and a three? 43. Okay, and what two numbers do you have? 75. Okay, and the biggest number is 75 with those two cards. Great, who has the biggest number, 43 or 75? 75. Okay, very good, so he takes them and puts them in his pile. Then they take two cards each. 110. 106. Alright, so let's look at these cards. If we put them this way, you could make 106. What if you place them this way? 610. Six, you have 610. And, and I have 810. And you have 810. So can you tell me who has the bigger number? I do. You do. Biggest number that each of you can make. Show me your cards. Good. 83. 83. <laughs> so we have a tie. Okay, so what we do in a tie is we place them right down here. And we take two more cards. Okay, what did you get? 86. You got 86 is the biggest number, and you got 77. 77. So they get all of the cards, including the ones from the last round that were a tie. A lot of cards. And then at the very end, when all of these cards are gone in the, in the bucket, then they count their cards in their pile, and whoever has the most cards is the winner. But is it about winning? No. no. What's it about? It's about having um, fun. Getting, getting mm -hmm. and being better mathematicians. I love that vocabulary word. Good job. It's about being better mathematicians. Let's try this in your classroom.